Ayy, chug it, bust it, why me turn nothing to something? When the trap hot jumping, don't try to jump in. Hey, what is good, A team? It's your boy, A T. No, hey, bruh, we are back with another food review, man. Feel like it's been at least like three, four months since we didn't dropped one. The last one we did was actually to, I think, the Wingstop chicken sandwich. But today, we got that Kentucky Fried. You feel me? We got that Kentucky Fried. Now, if y'all couldn't tell from the title, they just dropped the 2023 version of the KFC Double Down Chicken Sandwich. For all the ones who don't know, yes, it comes with two chicken breasts as the bun. Two slices of cheese in between mayo and bacon. Um, let me go ahead and read off these nutrition facts before we hop into it. It has 610 calories, 37 grams of fat, 18 grams of carbohydrates. I don't know if that really matters to y'all, but 1880 for the milligrams of sodium. 150 milligrams of cholesterol. <laughs> This thing is action packed, but a lot of people, I don't know, bro, because there's people who's like, oh, it's so unhealthy. But realistically, when I look at it, like when you break down what the sandwich is, yeah, just on the surface is very, I guess, unhealthy. But when you think about it, it's two chicken breasts. A lot of grown men out there can eat two chicken breasts and probably still eat some more. So you got two chicken breasts, two slices of cheese, some bacon and some mayo. Is that really OD? It's not really that OD, but just selling it as a chicken sandwich with two chicken breasts or chicken fillets as the bun is kind of crazy. Uh, we are also trying out the bacon and cheese chicken sandwich. So it's the same chicken sandwich that they've already been selling for the past like what year now. Um, but they added bacon, which I guess with the double down having bacon on it, because I didn't I didn't know KFC had bacon, but I'm guessing they probably added to the menu with the double down and then it's like, why not go ahead and add it to the sandwich? Mark that price up a little bit, you feel me? But right here, ooh, and that thing glowing. That thing glowing, my boy. Hold on, let me get y'all right. I'm gonna go ahead and just take this out. This is crazy though, bruh. The setup on this is OD. Got crust falling all out. Mm. The brother. Why it look like it's glowing though, for real. I think it's because of the because of the filter I got on my camera. Okay. Okay. Let me see if I can do these for y'all. Alright man, so here we go. As y'all see, we got the bacon on there, we got the cheese. Let's see if I can peel this open. These two slices of bacon, I ain't gonna lie, is a little lackluster. But these chicken fillets, these things are huge, bruh. These gotta be the same ones that they use for the chicken sandwich. Look like Swiss cheese on here. Oh, for the price of it, before we hop on into this first bite. If you order in through Uber Eats or DoorDash, bruh, they add like a dollar fifty or two fifty to almost everything that you order. So the, on the KFC app, or if you just like go to your KFC, at least where I'm at in VA. It's $8.99 for this double down. Which low. Hold on, we about to get a thumbnail with these, my boy. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Can we get those? I don't know, my guy. Either way, it's $9 for this before tax. $8.99. That's a lot. The bacon and cheese sandwich, $6.49 before tax. Which obviously the regular chicken sandwich was only $5, like $4.99. But either way, bro, it's a little bit too much talking. We about to get into this first bite of some cheese, right? Matter of fact, we gonna hit it right here. We gonna hit it right there. Mm. Mm. Hold on, Cole. Uh -uh. Mm. 
I ain't gonna lie, this thing actually is kind of good though. <laughs> now, if I wasn't doing this food review, I would have not, <clears throat> I wouldn't have went out of my way to get this sandwich. Even though it is kind of interesting, I wouldn't have went out of my way to get it. But the fact that I was gonna do the food review is what made me get it, but it's actually not bad. But for $9, would I still get it? No, I'd probably still just get a chicken sandwich with some fries. KFC, low key. When they fries is hot and salted, they got some of the, they can compete with some of the best fast food fries in my opinion. I didn't get no fries today, but they up there with like rallies, you feel me? All right, man. That's our last bite. For God, let me show y'all one time. I might, I'm gonna take one more. Mm. Bro. That double down. <clears throat> I can't lie to you, man. That thing hit. That cheese on it is unexpected. I've never really had. I don't really like. I don't typically like cheese on my chicken sandwiches, but they're actually pretty good. But hey, man, let's hop on into the new KFC bacon and cheese chicken sandwich. Was this is low key? This is the same thing as the double down. You just don't have two chicken breasts on it. Oh. 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 Hold on, coach. Let me pop the top on that for y'all. And I know it's so bright, bro. I'm trying to. There we go. Got me a couple pickles on the bottom. Okay. So let's get to it. It was at this moment that he knew he f***ed up. Hey, yo! Shoot. <laughs> Let me take one more. This mayo is crazy. <clears throat> so we done with those. We done with that. Keep the bucket, y'all, bro. The double down is better than the sandwich, hands down to me. The chicken breast on it seems like it's bigger on the double down than on the sandwich. And I feel like the bread being in the way, it don't really add nothing to the sandwich after you just took a bite of the double down. That's just me, bro. Y'all get down there in the comments. Y'all let me know what y'all thought. Because as y'all see, it's getting a little toasty in here. I ain't turning the air on because I ain't wanted to make a noise in the background. But the bacon and cheese chicken sandwich. I'm going to give it a... I low key, I think I would, I would rather take the regular sandwich over this one. Keep it a buck with you. Give me some extra mayo, extra pickles on it. That's just my opinion, though. The double down, that's all. That's like a 9 out of 10, Coach. I ain't going to let that thing. I don't know what it is. That flavor on there is hitting with the cheese mixed, the bacon, the mayo. Hey, that's all we was here for, though, bro. I appreciate y'all tuning in. Might have a couple more food reviews coming soon. Not too sure. I really just see a couple products drop here or there and decide if I want to do the review or not. But y'all get down there in the comments. Let me know what y'all thought or think about this new KFC uh, double down sandwich as well as the new bacon and cheese chicken sandwich. Let me know if y'all going to stop by and give it a little try. And if y'all do, come back and drop a comment. Let me know what y'all think, man. Either way, we on the road to 30K subscribers, 18. Appreciate all the love y'all been showing so far. 
Hey, y'all stay tuned. We got a Cancun, Mexico vlog dropping soon, brother. That's all I got to say, though, man. I'll catch y'all in the next video. Coach. Mm, Jeffrey B.